Hey guys, Mermaid Treasure Hunter here. We are about to go on one more fabulous adventure. I've brought you out to one of my favorite islands. We've been here before. Let's take a... Oh, don't forget to subscribe, you guys. If you haven't subscribed yet, I'm on to you. <laughs> All right, you guys, we are at the end of the runway of Naha Airport. So we are right downtown Naha where the majority of the inhabitants of this island live. So there's about 1.2 million people that live on this island and about a million people live right here in Naha. The rest of us live uh, to the north where it's a little more rural. And then if you can see those islands that are right out there on the horizon, that's the Karama Islands. They're just gorgeous. The best diving in the world is right there in the Karama Islands. All right, you guys. I'm gonna go gear up and get out there. As soon as I get a good signal, I'll turn the camera on. You guys, I got my first signal. I thought it was gonna be a bottle cap because it was really, really loud. It's just a 10 yen coin. All right. All right, there are signals a go-go everywhere. So let's, uh, let's just take a quick little view. Um, Ralph Macchio was here filming his Cobra Kai series, his Netflix Cobra Kai series and he stood in front of that rock right there. And you might recognize that rock. That's my uh, Mermaid Treasure Hunter logo picture where I'm standing there with the peace sign and I'm standing right in front of that rock. And so he did a little, he did a little YouTube video and he was standing right in front of that rock. And I'll tell you more about that rock when we get up All to right, it. All right, you guys, I got a 22 loud, loud signal. And I didn't turn the camera on because I thought it was going to be, you know, like something crusty, a five yen coin or a key, something no good. Look at this fun, fun car. It's got little gold on it. How fun is that? Okay, you guys, I have, oh, it's out. Another 1718, please be a $5 coin. Uh-oh, I think it's whatever this is. Let's see. Uh-oh. Well, I don't know. Hold on. Okay, this is the 18. That's no good. Whatever this is, no good. No bueno, just a piece of metal. Now, there's a 22 right here. What is that? Huh. Boy, there are just signals everywhere. Let's see. It says it's four inches down. Let's try this way, because I'm kind of fighting some coral right here. All right, 24, 25, and a negative five. <laughs> oh, we've got some crazy signals. Oh, I see it, it's a bottle cap, I think. There it is, bottle cap. Okay, you guys, I have a, uh-oh. <laughs> I think I threw it down on another thing. I have a 18, 19, let's see. something right here there's there's like two different signals here now and I think I threw it down on a signal so that's no good let's see I think something's in the soup besides a lot of coral oh <laughs> and that's a five yen coin that's really really crusty Woo! I don't even know if I'll be able to get that cleaned up we'll give it a shot though <laughs> you guys this is just crazy all these signals okay it's out Let's see. Ooh, this is a little uh, sketchy, like um, bouncy, you know, like, um, no, that's not it. Let's see, do we have it here maybe? Okay, I think, I think we have it in the scoop. And wow. Oh my goodness, look at this. 
I would have never seen that. I would have thought it was coral, except for that little tiny bit of metal hanging out. All right. Boy, that's a first for me. That must mean that there's a lot of trash here. All right, you guys, here is, let's keep our fingers crossed. It's, um, oh, a bottle cap. I see it right there. Hello, hello. Boy, that sure did make a lot of noise. A lot, a lot of noise. All right. Well, we're getting some bottle caps, you guys. I guess that's good. Oops, and there's lots and lots of people here. Hey, this drink was lemon. I could go for a lemon drink right now. Lemon. Awesome. Nope. I think it's just this beaver tail right here. Yep, it's a folded over beaver tail, guys. Wow. Wow. You know, I guess it's a good thing to do a video like this because a lot of you have been saying that you've been getting nothing but trash. Now, Gary G, he's a subscriber. He's been sending me pictures of his first ring he ever found, then the second and third ring he ever found. I said, man, you are one lucky dude. One of them looks like it's gold with, um, you know, gemstones in it. It looks a little bit like my wedding ring because it has a ruby and it has diamonds and it has sapphires, which is exactly what my wedding ring has. So here's a really big 2327 right in the middle of this fire pit. And there's some aluminum. I'm guessing that this is just, I'm guessing that's just a can. Let's see. Oh yeah, look how high we are and we can hear it. Yeah, that was a can. Okay, let's keep going. Okay, you guys, here's a 1718 right at the surface. Please be a $5 coin. Please be a $5 coin. That would be so awesome. Oh, nope, didn't get it out. Let's see, I don't hear it either. Did I turn it on its side or, oh, <laughs> look at this. Oh my God, it's the top of a can and it just got stuck to my metal detector, or my scoop. <laughs> ah, oh my goodness, all right. Well, that fooled me for sure. I knew we had a $5 coin coming. All right, oh, you wow. guys, here is a 25, 26, 28, 22. <laughs> I have a feeling it'll be a Tinian coin or possibly a quarter. I did find a quarter here before, but whenever I see a 27, I get pretty positive that it's gonna be a one yen coin. So that last sweep was a 28. Let's see, it's out. It is out. Mm. It says it's right here. Let's see. Let's cover this back up because it's right here somewhere. <laughs> Let's just kick this. Oh, there it is. Tinian. See, sometimes all you have to do is just kick it. <laughs> There's some people with a ferret on the beach down there. Tinian. All right. All right, you guys. Here's a 14. I saw it go to a 15. I saw it go to a 13. So, yeah, I don't know. Oh, my goodness. What the heck have we got in here? <laughs> I don't know how we get so lucky and get these nasty, nasty things. I just don't know what that even Guys, is. I'm gonna tell you about that rock right there. My, my um, metal detector keeps going off. Um, that rock right there. So it's the reproduction of the child treasure rock. There's two holes, the upper hole and the lower hole. And people who visited would pray that they would be blessed with children. And then they would throw a small stone into the upper hole when they would want a baby boy. And otherwise the lower hole would um, give them a baby girl. And so um, that's kind of a fun, fun little 
thing, but I wish that they would say, oh, you throw a $5 coin. <laughs> And if it lands in the top hole, you get a baby boy. And if it lands in the bottom hole, you get a baby girl. But anyway, that's the story of that rock. Kind of fun. My handsome daddy is home. <laughs> well, you guys, that might be the last time we go to that beach because, wow, a 10 yen coin, a 5 yen coin, and a really fun car. Now, I do like a fun car. Um, but so much trash in my ears. Oh my goodness, it's just too much, too many signals. I don't know how you park hunters, you know, like in trashy parks where it's just beep, 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 and you're trying to decide what signal to dig. Oh my goodness. I probably left, you know, a gold ring behind because I wasn't about to dig a 1415. You know, so especially, you know, like if I had 12, 13, that's a dollar. I'll dig that all day long. But when the minute I see 14, forget it, forget it. And there was just so many buried cans and things. Ugh, it was too much, too much. Let's take a look real quick. Oh, don't forget to subscribe, you guys. If you haven't subscribed yet, I'm on to you. <laughs> no, come on, subscribe and hit the notification bell so that you know when we're on our next adventure. And make sure you comment. I love comments, so make sure you comment. Let's look at the trash first. All right, I forgot that we got two 10 yen coins. So this one's definitely gonna have to go through the tumbler because whoo, that doesn't look so good, does it? No, it doesn't. And then here's that five yen coin. Let's see if we can break this off. Hey, we broke a piece of the coral off. All right, well, I don't know that that's gonna come clean. I just, just from past experience. Here's that super fun car. I don't know if you can tell that that's gold on there. Okay, oh, there, it got really clear. It's got little gold highlights. I think I'm gonna have to get some gold fingernail polish and try to go over those highlights again because this is really a cool card, super fun. And I'm pretty sure we're not gonna be able to read it. It doesn't say, like, it says something, but I think that it's so corroded that we can't see what it says. So that's okay, that's okay. And then here's, well, this I thought was gonna be a 500 yen coin, but I'm pretty sure it's not. I think it's just some piece of metal. It just doesn't sound right. You know, even this doesn't, it just sounds different. And then we got all this, oh God, how about this one that was just covered in coral? <laughs> how about a stay tab? Woo, that's gotta be old. But just all these bottle caps and crazy pieces of metal and you know, it's just too much, too much trash. So, yep, we're not going to that beach again, I decided. Anyway, you guys, I will see you on the next hunt.